Hi viewers, welcome to my channel. I'm Sanapa. So this video we will see what is the uh, difference between soft starters and BFD starters. Okay. So we will see. Uh, we are not going to discuss about internal circuit and all. We will see application wise, use wise, what is the different where we can use uh, soft starters, where we can use VFDs, and why the uh, what is the different between these uh, two items. We will see in this video. Okay, first we will see common things like uh, why we are using these soft starters VFDs. Okay, so we know very well motors. Okay, so big size of motor when we are starting uh, with a dual starter, starter to starter, the starting current is, uh, will be very high. Okay, so due to this um, starting current, there is a chance of mechanical damage also. Uh, <coughs> power loss okay so to avoid these kind of things we are using soft starters and vfds okay but why we are using uh, somewhere soft starter why we are using somewhere vfds we will see okay so first we will see soft starter okay so the name itself it is soft starter okay this is a starter okay smooth starter or soft starter okay so this soft starter is used to only start stop the motor or equipment okay but VFD is variable frequency drive. So it is a drive. Okay. So it is used for start, stop and running the equipment or motor. Okay. So this is the main difference. Okay. Bypass the after full speed. Okay. So if, if you use this sub starter, uh, after uh, once this motor started, okay, once it is reached full speed, the by the uh, <coughs> soft starter will be bypassed by a bypass contactor that means the power source will be bypassed from soft starter and it will be given to directly to the power source okay but vfd vfd some case okay emergency case only we can use uh, bypass starter like if vfd is not working it is fault okay that case you can add bypass starter and we can run the uh, equipment in emergency case okay so bypass only when the VFD is not working okay if it is necessary okay and once you are running this uh, your equipment by sub starter you cannot uh, uh, do the speed control of your equipment okay with sub starter you can uh, give smooth start and you can con uh, <laughs> run the equipment with full speed only you cannot do speed control okay but in VFD speed control is possible okay you can control the speed of your motor or your equipment <laughs> by adjusting the uh, speed in the VFDs okay so this is the major uh, like important difference between soft starter and uh, VFDs okay then no starting uh, starting torque okay so once the uh, one when we are using this soft starter this will give smooth start only okay but <coughs> this soft starter cannot be used for all the equipments like the equipment where you need uh, <coughs> starting torque like crane motor conveyor motor some heavy machineries okay so these all equipments uh, starting with uh, full load okay so that case there you need uh, starting torque to <coughs> give the uh, boost start okay this case stop starter is not possible to run the heavy machinery or where you need starting torque okay but vfd VFDs are available with a uh, type of where uh, it will boost the starting torque. Okay, so you can run heavy machinery like crane motor, conveyor motor, or any other gear coupled motors. Okay, so then this stop starter is mainly uh, used in the pump applications. Okay, this stop starter is mainly used in the uh, water pumps application and especially for transfer pumps where we no need of speed control. Okay. Uh, especially for submersible pumps okay uh, bigger size submersible pumps so for the submersible pumps uh, most of this sub is used and recommended okay these VFDs also used in pump application especially in booster application where you want to maintain such a pressure or uh, like uh, uh, <coughs> water level of the tank where you want you want to do the speed control of the motor okay this case this VFD is mainly used okay and external protection okay 
<laughs> you, you, once you use this soft starter, you have to give all kind of protection externally, like overload protection, sub circuit protection, any air fall protection. You have to give externally because this will do only. Uh, this will give only smooth start and stop of this motor. Okay, but VM is. <coughs> All kind of uh, protection is inbuilt with this VFD, uh, like over voltage, under voltage, over frequency, under frequency, um, over current, air fault. Mm, most of the protection is covered with this VFDs. Okay, that case, that's the case. Soft starter is cheaper than VFDs. That means VFD is expensive than the soft starters. Okay, so when you are selecting your starter. You make sure what kind of application you are using. So whether you want to use soft starter or VFDs, okay. So I hope you understand whatever I explained you. So you will do in your projects and you will select your starter type uh, clearly, okay. So thanks for watching. If you are new for my channel, please do subscribe, okay, and watch my previous videos posted. I will meet you in next video. Till then, bye from Senapa.